Welcome back to Krendor's Adventurers. Now you might notice some fancy new technology down here right below me. There should be a death counter showing up now. I got, first of all, uh, this is the first recording I'm making using OBS Studio instead of Bandicam. So hopefully we'll get less hitching in the game now and then. And also that allows me to do this little thing down here with the death counter. Uh, so now, whenever I die, I just have to push F12, and that number will go up. And now I don't have to go back and rewatch the episodes myself, and use... Uh, for the past the 16 episodes, I've been using uh, the YouTube annotations to do the death counter manually, which has been a big pain in the butt. Plus, this is going to look nicer, I think. Also, I need to go back for a second because... Where was it? This was the best one. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. I've been playing a couple of other characters on the side. I've been careful to make sure that the other characters I play off camera do not go any further into the game than this character is. So... I haven't seen any extra stuff yet. But I have learned a few things in general. Such as, I'm here because I've learned that this is where I need to get a uh, Sunlight Medallion to become a Sunbro. And I missed it with this character. Oh, also a couple other things I learned is what this stuff is all about. I can actually edit this, and I'll put this here. So that's why they have the... Um, the sort of faded out stamp instead of the red stamp because I can put it here so that way I have the homeward bone available for use whenever I want it but it's not in my um, same slot with my potions it's taking up the slot down there so that's one little thing I learned it's kind of useful That's not how I wanted that to go, but it works. So just over here in that house full of all the hanging bodies, there was that um, there was that door in the basement I never figured out how to open. Now I know how. Also, I turned down the sound effects slightly, so hopefully the smashing of objects and whatnot won't be quite as crazy loud anymore. We'll see. Dude, I don't really feel like fighting everybody here. So I'll just fight a few of them, and then go in. So in here, and then... Here, we've got this hole. Here we have our Warrior of Sunlight. Let's do that. Now, I'm not sure how the, the covenants work in this game. So, this is how I join them, but I don't know how I advance in them. Because in the other ones, they... In previous games, there was an altar, and then you would take, you would get multiple medallions of sunlight, and bring them there and offer them up as proof of your deeds. In this one, I'm not really sure how that works. So I'm officially a sunbro now, but I don't know how I'm gonna get new spells out of it. <clears throat> like, I don't know how I get my rewards, I don't know how I advance in rank, I don't know what any of this is. Anyways, I'm just going to leave this area now. I'm not going to waste a homework bone on it, but I'm just going to run out, ignore those people. 
Now let's get out of here, shall we? Okay, was there anything else I wanted to do on the side? I don't think so. I think we can get right in on the important stuff now. But I do want to check... Hmm. Yeah, try something. I think you can maybe use any of these sacrificial alterings to just boost whatever covenant you're in now. I don't know. I'm gonna try it. Okay. Can I just use? No. I don't know then. Oh well. Let's just continue with the story. Everything in this zone. Uh, what if I can do, get to where I need to go while avoiding that uh, that crab? You're a little, a little bit of a pain. Oh, you bastard! Take that. pile of these guys. pike from them, not just a big sharpened stick that's being used as a pike. It's kind of funny. Oh, didn't see you. Super well. Um, let's try resting at the spot up here. I think there was a bonfire here, wasn't there? Yeah. Okay, let's reset here. Oh, I never 
went down these these sort of steps. There we go. Need to be something. Had to be something. I know what happens if they grab you. I don't remember if that actually happened to me already. <laughs> this is my third sit down with the game and I don't remember if it happened to me my last sit down because it was a couple days ago. Cost me two Estus, not terrible. Ew. One of my other characters I made was a dexterity character just to try it out, and that uh, you you start with game with that one if you make a. It's called a mercenary. Oh sweet. Anyway, it's the class that starts with the highest dexterity, and they start with that weapon, and it is garbage. It is really bad. Even with a good dexterity, it's bad. So, do not recommend that at all to anyone, ever. Gonna have to fight this crab at least. Hey, come here. Come on. Let's, let's, let's fight. Roll. That was too slow. God, you're gross. Get over there. Just want to double check to see if I got any of these spells as a result of joining the Covenant. And no, I did not. Hello, little guy. Killed your daddy. Oh, hi. Oh. 
Oh dear. There's two of you. I don't like it. At least the other guy seems to be stuck. Makes me feel slightly better. do that? How is that even possible? Behind me. Oh no. I don't like it. Okay, got him. Okay. Oh, that was lucky. Exile, huh? much negated it with your healing, but still. At least I negated your heal as well. We negated each other equally. No. There we go. I don't know how I got to him in time, but I did. I'll take it. Okay, I knew something scary was going to happen over here, which is why I left it for last. Way to go. Is this. Oh. Uh, hi, buddy. Back send the, spend these souls, I think. That's what I'm gonna do. Also, I like the fact that the homeward bone allows you to travel directly to Firelink Shrine. That's convenient. special other than spending the souls here. Well, very well that he Okay, what do I want to increase that? I think uh, Let's get some luck. Why not? 
Farewell, Ashen One. May the... Thank you, very lady. Um... Is there a thing... Try to talk to this guy again. You got anything new? Oh, our champion of ash. Welcome back. You got your faces I would in do me. anything for my master. Just say the word. As I have said, but I, I'm weeping. But though, can I do this again? Then shall we begin? Yeah, I can. Sweet. Bearer of the dark sign, let your true strength shine. Yeah, more free level ups. Awesome. Let's take another point of luck. Fifteen sounds nice. Then shall we bear? Oh my god. How many times can I do this? This is going to go badly for me at some point, isn't it? As I have a... We be oh safe. I keep thinking after all that he's going to do something different, but he never does. So this drawing out strength and free level up seems to be connected to some sort of new stat called hollowing. I can't help but think this is going to do something bad to me in the long run, but it'll be interesting to see at least, right? We're not playing to be optimal, we're playing see what interesting shit happens along the way. Yeah. Alright. This is really... Yeah, this is the only way I can go. You're the thing that's making the goopy noise. Okay. Alright, this seems to be poisonous water like the uh like blight <laughs> like the area at the bottom of blight town anyway so maybe I should switch to some gear that's more poison resisted Poison resist I can get with what I've got on me. Wow, look at all of you. So many of you. like that place. Um, ragged mask. Yeah, not as good as the hat I've got. to actually put these in? Are these even the flames that we're talking about? I don't even know. Okay, I need to test something. I'm just going underneath these goopy 
sacks do anything. Apparently not. Okay. They're a decoration, not a danger. I think. Unless they don't all act the same, in which case, maybe they're just trying to trick me. Who even knows? I do have a spell that'll cure poison, but I don't want to have to use it up too much. Right there. Ride this up for a bit and see how bad it is. Looks like there's a few sections where it just can't be avoided anyway. It seems to be damaging me very slowly, which makes it like Dark Souls 1 poison. Dark Spot looks very suspicious. Very slow poison. Added together with actually getting nibbled by monsters makes it certainly ungood. Your wit is so flay like that. Okay, uh, let's do what else we can in the poison. Being in here while I'm poisoned doesn't make it any worse, so let's just. Take advantage. seems to be stopping me from backstabbing them. Interesting. Seems like it. Could have a lot of poison exploring to do. Ooh, two new coals. It's unexpected. Hmm. Don't 
if there's any dry ground coming up. But it's time to end this episode, so thanks for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying the new Death Counter. I'll see you next time.